Two children are in serious condition tonight after an accident that brought the evening commute to a standstill. News Channel 5's Curtis Jackson is live in the newsroom now with the latest. Curtis? Alicia, it was one of those scenes firefighters and police dread. A high speed crash involving multiple vehicles with several people injured, including an infant. Definitely could have been worse. Uh, you know, I mean, that could have been a, a semi that we rendered them. Cleveland firefighters say a car on 90 East near Dead Man's Curve came to a dead stop in the high speed lane inside a mother and her two children. The car that the children were in was rear ended. Uh, it appears was off to the side. Uh, there was a car possibly didn't see them and rear ended it. And um, there was quite a lot of damage to the rear of the car and side of the car. The children are six years old and three months. The three month old appeared to be the most serious injured. Um, you know, the other children were injured also, but with our main concern was the three month old. Uh, she seemed to be unresponsive at the time. Firefighters began CPR and managed to stabilize the infant. She just looked a little dazed. Um, for a small baby like that. She was in a car seat. Her uh, sister was also in a car seat, too, so we're very fortunate there. The family was rushed to Metro Health Medical Center along with several other motorists. The children are in serious condition. Firefighters hope the accident serves as a warning for others. Get the right hand berm, get out of your car, uh, call the police or call AAA uh, to get yourself some assistance. The names of the victims have not been released. Firefighters say five cars were involved in the accident. The total number of people injured is pending a report by the Accident Investigation Unit of the Cleveland Police. In the newsroom, Curtis Jackson, News Channel 5. An important reminder to always buckle up those kids. Indeed. All right. Thank you, Curtis.